Hey, what's going on guys and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I have an update for you guys from the last video for the jailbreak update for iOS 10.2.1. So with that being said, let's get straight into this video. Also guys, thank you guys so much for all the likes in yesterday's video. Let's go ahead and try to smash 15 likes on this video as well for another iOS jailbreak update video. And also don't forget to comment something down below for a chance to get pinned. All right, so first off, I'm gonna go ahead and cover what I forgot to cover in the last video regarding the last jailbreak that I told you guys about that is possibly, that is going to be the next jailbreak that's gonna be announced to the public working and stable. So with that being said, let me go ahead and show you guys. So first off, today, someone was apparently successful in the jailbreak for iOS 10.2.1, and that pretty much shows that this jailbreak might be possible for the future for any other person that has a iDevice on iOS 10.2.1. So as you guys can see, it does say you are already jailbroken by the application called Saigon, and there are a couple questions for some people that are on it saying how if it does work or if it does not work, but let's just hope that someone actually compiles it, fixes some bugs, put some offsets inside of the jailbreak for more devices to be compatible with this particular jailbreak. Now, if you guys watched my last video, I'm gonna go ahead and just cover the things that I forgot to show you guys. But like I said in my last video, Triple Fetch, Ziva, as well as Extra Recipe was compiled all together by an unknown developer inside of the jailbreak community to make this jailbreak possible. And the link inside of this post right here brings us to the GitHub, which shows the Xcode project for the Saigon jailbreak. Now, I do not have a iDevice running iOS 10.2.1, but if you guys are willing to try this jailbreak and have a Mac computer in order to use Xcode, then go ahead and I'll go ahead and leave this link inside of the description to go ahead and check out the Saigon jailbreak. Now, the next thing I do want to talk about that I completely forgot to talk about in yesterday's video is the fact that iOS 10.3.3 was actually being signed again by Apple. I'm not too sure why they made this particular iDevice signed again, but only the iPhone 6S is currently also being signed with iOS 10.3.3. All other devices are only available for iOS 11.0.1 .1 as well as 11.0.2. But like I said, the iPhone 6S is the only device that only has iOS 10.3.3 being signed at the moment. So with that being said, if you guys have not yet saved your SHSH blobs, go ahead and save them because this might be crucial for a jailbreak, possibly for an iPhone 6S, if we are able to get one for this particular iDevice. Now, the last thing I do wanna talk about is Timstar regarding the ETA Sun jailbreak. And if you guys do not know, this jailbreak is also available now for the iPhone 5 as well as the iPad 4. So go ahead, if you guys want, you guys can go ahead and check out the ETA Sun jailbreak, which is only for iOS 8.4.1 on a 32-bit device. So if you guys have these particular iDevices running this iOS version, you guys can go ahead and get the untethered jailbreak for iOS 8.4.1 with Timstar's jailbreak. So that's pretty much it, guys. That's all I wanted to cover for this video. I forgot to cover a couple of things in yesterday's video, but there are some new information regarding the iOS 10.2.1 jailbreak that might be, in fact, useful for us in the future to see a next jailbreak. So with that being said, guys, if you guys like this video, go ahead and leave a like down below also subscribe to get videos just like this in the future as well as a lot more videos regarding the jailbreak community in the future as well don't forget to also snapshot this outro and follow me on twitter and facebook to be informed on anything jailbreak related and to be up to date on what's been going on inside of the jailbreak world so with that being said guys i'll see you guys in my next video this is elite apple hacks signing out